In this lesson you will see what is the difference between MT4 and MT5 trading platform, where you will see which platform has best options and which platform is best to use as a beginner or advanced user. And I will show you a few examples in the difference between visual design and also functionality. But at the end you will see and decide which trading platform is the best for you and which options are best suited to you. First of all, if you want to download MT4 free platform, you can do that by visiting the link below in the description of this video, where you can download for free and you can open a demo account without a broker. All the instructions are below on the link. Now let's go. Here you can see on the left side it is MT4 trading platform and on the right side it is MT5. When you check it like this, they are pretty similar, but there are slight differences between them. In a visual design you can see that the MT4 has a light version of colors and also all the buttons. And if you check it here on the MT5, you can see that some of the functions have much better design compared to the MT4. And this is the reason, the main reason is because the MT5 is a new version of MetaTrader platform and it has better functionalities and also better visual design, because it is a 64 bits version compared to the MT4 which is 32 bits version. If you compare other things, you will see what is the difference between them. Let's go. First of all, let's check the upper part where are the quick access toolbar. If you check, you can see that they are similar and they have similar functions. But some of them are available in MT5, which are not available in MT4. But the main functions like time frames are also available here in the quick access toolbar. Then if you check here the objects, for example drawing horizontal or vertical lines or channels, they are same as here in MT4. Then you have up, up here in the upper row you have also view windows which are for example market watch, navigator, terminal, but here in the MT5 you have also these windows to activate or deactivate, but some of them are added more here in MT5 compared to the MT4. If you check here, for example, pressing a view button here and then you check here which windows you can have, you can see that most of them are the similar. There are, for example, difference in the toolbox, which is a terminal here in MT4. They have renamed this window instead of calling terminal in the MT5 it is called a toolbox. Then let's go about let's go and check each of these parts that are similar or are the different. For example, you could see in on the internet that some some saying that MT4 doesn't support crypto trading. But that's not quite quite true because if your broker allows you on MT4 trading crypto currencies, you can do that. For example, here on IC markets where I have, it is possible to have cryptocurrency here for trading. So it's not a problem to get them on MT4. So compared to MT5 where it is also possible to trade cryptocurrencies, so there is no much difference between MT4 and MT5. Just a minute, I don't... IC markets, just a minute, I will activate IC markets, so I have both of them IC markets. Now you can see for example on MT5, on IC markets, the broker I am using, there is also possibility to trade Bitcoin USD. So it's not a problem in, a, in the MT4 or MT5 platform, but the difference between them is not in these symbols. So. If you see someone saying that you cannot trade MD4 with cryptocurrencies, that's not quite correct. It depends all on the broker. Then the next thing is the time frames. For example, inside MT4 you have nine time frames: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And if you want to see them, you can also do that by going to charts, time frames, and select one of these nine which are available. 
the shortcuts is here in the quick access toolbar. But if you go to the MT5, there are also nine of time frames visible here in the quick access toolbar. But if you go to the charts and go to the time frames, you will see that you have much more time frames available. For example, there are nine of these standard ones, which are also available in MT4, but you have here more, more of them from one minute to 10 minutes and then 12, 15, 20 and 30 minutes. Then you have also hours, which you can divide into 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 6, 8 and 12 hours. So the MT5 has much more options regarding the time frames, so it is better than the MT4 because it offers you much more time frames to analyze the chart. Then the next thing which you have in MT5 and you do not have in MT4 is here the calendar. For example, if you want to check all the news that will appear on the market today or the next day, you can watch them here. For example, today is 27th of October and you can see which are the news today's published. So you can use this calendar to watch the market and expect what will be the volatility for the certain currency pair. You do not need to go to, go to the Forest Factory and check the calendar because you have everything here available. But on the MT4 this is not available. There is no calendar available so you need to go to the internet somewhere and check the calendar for the Forex market and see which news are published and what you can expect when they are published. So compared to the between MT4 and MT5, the MT5 has advantage of using calendar directly on trading platform. Then there is uh, one option inside both MT4 and MT5, it is called the mailbox. Just a minute, I'll return this one here. Let's go to the mailbox. Okay, here it is and here it is. So there is a possibility that you can send an email directly to the server of your broker if you want to do that. Go to the mailbox and click the right mouse button and click the button create. When you click that there is a possibility here to make a subject of this email and also the text of the and the body. But you have a possibility to send this message to your broker server if you want to do that. It's not possible to send an email to someone over the trading platform. If you go to the MT5 and also inside the mailbox and click the right mouse button here in the mailbox, click the create. And then you will see that there is more options in this window for the new message. The same case is with uh, for the sending to, it is also really related only to the broker server. So it's not possible to send to someone else or to you or this trading platform. Then you can insert the subject, but there is much more possibilities here when you put some kind of the text. In MT4 this is no, there is no possibility to edit the text, for example change the font and, and or anything else, but it's a simple sending a message, plain message. But if you go to the MT5 there is a possibility to make some kind of changes on this text and also changing the font if you want to do that. But also you have a possibility to put the attachment which will be sent with the message. Which in case of the MT4 this is not possible to make any changes or add any attachments. So if you compare these two options between MT4 and MT5, MT5 has much more settings allow us to change the text and edit the text in a way you want. Which is in today's time is pretty normal to have these all options. Next thing which is uh, good to compare is the objects. And the objects are located here, one of them, and also uh, in MT4 are located here. If you check all the objects in MT4 and MT5, most of them are the same, but there is slight difference. In MT4 you have totally 31 objects, and also in MT5 you have 44 objects. So when you check them, you can do that, go to the insert and then go to these objects. So you have lines, channels, GAN, Fibonacci, shapes and arrows. And when you go here in MT5, you have also here objects, everything located here under the objects. 
So when you go through each of these, you will see that there is a difference and MT5 has much more objects. If you want to check them at a one place, compared to between MT4 and MT5, you can do that, go to the blog and check, check the image I have put there. So for example, you have here objects in MT4 and then you have here objects in MT5. You can easily see by watching these two images that there is a big difference between MT4 and MT5. But again, the difference between MT4 and MT5 are very little and all and those objects that, that are inside in MT5 and in, that they are not inside in MT4 are pretty rarely used. So in your trading you will not use them a lot and you will not see any difference between them. So if we compare an MT5 and MT4 regarding the objects, there is slight difference between them, MT5 has much more of them, but they do not give you advantage over trading. Next thing what we can check here is the number of indicators. In MT4 indicators are located here inside the navigator window and also in MT5 the same inside the navigator under indicators. When you check them all and compare them all between MT4 and MT5 there is a big difference. MT4 has 50 of them here located and MT5 has 92. So that is difference of 42 indicators. But again those 42 the difference doesn't give you any advantage because most of those used indicators in trading platform MT4 and MT5 are located in both trading platforms. So you will not see any difference except if you are using special indicators that are located here in MT5. I will not go through, e through each of them, but again you can go to the Getno Trading blog and there you can see the difference between them. For example, go here between MT4 and MT5 indicators and there you will see what is the difference. MT4 are located on the left side here and also, and also the indicators are located here on the right side for the MT5. What you cannot see here on the right or on the right side is the samples on MT5 because there are a lot of them and I did not put them all here. But if you go below down here, you will see inside the table each of these indicators divided into categories. For example, these are the trend indicators here, trend indicators, and then go to here oscillator indicators. Then there is volume indicator and then Bill Williams indicators and then example indicators. In this big table, example indicators, you will see that where is the difference because the MT4 goes up to here, yes, yes, and then go MT5 go down to the bottom, which gives an, an MT5 a big difference between MT4 and MT5. Let's go back to the MT4 and MT5. Then in the MT4 and MT5 there is one difference in the accounts and that is, for example, if you have two or three accounts with the same broker, for example, I have here in MT4 MetaQuotes demo and I have, and I have here in MetaQuotes again demo but MT5, there is a possibility that you make a transfer of funds between accounts. So if I go to the MT5 here and click the right mouse button on this account, I have an option transfer funds. So I am able to transfer from this account to this account, which is inside the same broker, some of the amount of this account. So this option is available only in MT5. If I go here to the MT4 and I click right mouse button, there is no this option transfer funds which is available in MT5. This is a feature that is available inside an MT5 and which is pretty nice to have it but in MT4 it's not possible. So if you would like to have this, MT5 allows you to make the transfer between these two accounts with the same broker. But have in mind that the condition is to be active 
this account in MT5 and this account has another account with the same broker. If you have another broker here, you cannot change between these two accounts because they are with a different broker. It's not possible, which is illogical. Then there is an extra option which is available in MT4 and MT5 and that is the chat option. If you go to the MT4 inside view, you have a possibility to log into the chat to the MQL5 community. The same thing is available inside in MT5, so there is no difference between these two trading platforms. Then there is a big difference inside the MT4 and MT5 regarding the strategy tester. If I open strategy tester inside MT4, you will see the standard one which is usually used in MT4 and much more known than the MT5. But if I go to the MT5 and I click the strategy tester, you will see a big difference. Inside an MT4 you have simple option to, to use indicator or the expert advisor that you want to test. And then among expert advisor you select which expert advisor you want to test and then select the period and also the visual mode. Then when you go to the MT5 there is much more options which you can use and you have much more options and there one of the best options is to at the same time test more of expert advisor on indicator so this option in MT5 gives you much more advanced compared to the MT4 because the MT4 his 64 bits version of trading platform has much more functionalities which allows you much more charts visual settings and which gives you much faster testing and also the back testing of the expert advisor or indicators. I will not go through each of them with the samples, you can check that on other blog posts, but this is the dif difference between MT4 and MT5. And in this case, MT5 is better than the MT4. The next thing which MT4 and MT5 have uh, is the depth of the market. When you go to the chart and click right mouse button, you can open the depth of the market. And what you can see here is the depth of the market window where you can see the prices which are above and below the current market price. I will not go through depth of the market, what is and how to use it. You have another video for that and you can check that on the Get No Trading website. When you go to the MT4 and click right mouse button, there is also depth of the market. So both of these trading platform have depth of the market, but there is difference between them. MT4 and MT5 uh, have the same buttons, sell and buy and also the close and also options to set stop loss and take profit and the volume, which is also available here. There is also the prices and also the trade options, which are pending orders inside MT4 and there is also on MT5. What you can see, what, what is the difference is the volume column here, which is in MT5, which is not available in MT4. But there is also option here to activate this option and this option is tick chart on the depth of the market, which is not available in MT4. Then there is option here, uh, times and sales, which allows you to see open orders but this, available, this is not available right now because I need to have a live account open here on MT5. But for example, on MT4, there is no option for that. So MT4 is a light version of depth of the market and has less functionalities than the MT5. But for trading, the functionality that are inside an MT4 are enough compared to the MT5. So there is no big advantage in trading in MT5 compared to the MT4 regarding depth of the market. I will close depth of the market here and here. Then let's go to the orders. When you want to open an order in MT5, you go here and click new order. Then the new window appears. Then I will put here in the pending orders so we can see what pending orders are allowed. Now inside the type drop down menu you can see that I have totally 6 of pending orders. The standard ones are buy limit, sell limit, buy stop, sell stop, but additional two are buy stop limit and sell stop limit. When I go here to the MT4 and click this window and go to the pending orders and inside the type, go inside the type, I have only 4 standard pending orders. 
So compared to the MT4, MT5 has two more pending orders. But in trading, usually are used these four are used these four standard ones. So the advantage on MT5 is slightly better, but it's not too much and not so crucial in trading. So if you want to have two more options for the pending orders, you can have them. But if you are using simple ones, the standard ones, the MT4 is enough. I will close this one and also this one. There is a difference between MT4 and MT5, which I already have mentioned at the start, and that is the MT5 is a 60-bit, 64-bit version of a platform and the MT4 is 32 bits platform. What does that mean? It means something like this. If you check this image, there is a comparison which I have found on, on the internet where you can see the millions of operations per second on one Intel core. And the difference is pretty big where we have here a 60-bit version has much more power to process operations. And this gives a pretty big advantage to the MT5 compared to the MT4. When we check what I already have said, for example, strategy tester and also the visual appearance on MT5 is much better than the MT4 because the MT4 is a light version and has less options and also possibilities compared to the MT5. So 64-bit version is much more advanced compared to the MT4 to 2-bit version so mt5 will have much more functionalities and also the future in in the future because mt5 is upgrading all the time and mt4 doesn't update anymore from metaquotes company so mt4 will stay like this except if your broker put some kind of update you will receive it but the MT5 will be used in the future much more because of the functionalities added and also possibilities for trading. Now, moving forward and uh, checking what is the difference in 64-bit and also 32-bit version is, for example, an MT5 report and MT4 report account history. This is a standard report what you can see here in MT4 when you go to the right mouse button and you put here save as detail report you can get a report directly in the web browser or inside inside file downloaded to your PC but the MT5 has same functionality here going right mouse button in the account history and then going to report here and open XM in MS Office or HTML, Internet Explorer. But there is one option here which is not available in NT4 and that is the report here directly in this window, which gives you much more advantage compared to NT4. You do not need to download or open Internet Browser to see the difference. So this MT5 option to see a report with the charts and also the graph here inside the MT5 trading platform is much better option. And the 64-bit version of the platform allows this. In a 32-bit version, it's not possible to have. So there is a difference between MT4 and MT5 and MT5 has big advantage in the reporting inside the platform. So, this is all about the difference between MT4 and MT5. I hope I have explained a little bit about what versions you have for trading and what is the difference between them. At the end, I can make a conclusion that the MT4 has all the functions that you need for trading, especially if you are a beginner, you have everything to start trading. MT5 has also the same functions as MT4 and has much more better visual appearance because it is 64-bit vision of trading platform. The visual buttons are much more better and also there is much more features available inside in MT5. And in the future, MT4, MT5 version will be updated and upgraded by the MetaQuotes, but MT4 will not be because MetaQuotes has stopped updating this trading platform. So if you want to start trading, I will suggest using MT4 because it is pretty reliable and it is robust and much more traders are using MT4 than the MT5. And you as a beginner will have all 
all what is needed to start trading. And especially much more indicators and also much more expert advisors are built on MT4 than the MT5. There is also a light, uh, slightly version in programming language where the MT4 is using MQL4, which is pretty easy to understand, and MT5 is using MQL5, which is based on C++, which is object-oriented programming, which is much more complicated and complex. So, you can make conclusion on yourself, if you, know, if you want, you can start immediately with MT5. You will see that most brokers are offering both of these versions, but I think uh, the MT4 is much more covered with the brokers than the MT5. But in the future this could change because the MT5 is updated constantly and upgraded by the Metacode, so this will give advantage against MT4. So I hope you like this lesson. If you like it, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and happy trading!